Hey guys, this is Lounge Styles, and uh, this is a video talking about. Wait a minute. Something doesn't seem right about this. Wait. Oh, I know what's wrong. There we go. Now it's better. Okay. If y'all haven't realized yet, no more commentaries. It's gone. A moment of silence for the fallen channel. Silence over! I mean, NMC is gone, but you know what? I wouldn't change a thing about it. I really wouldn't. I mean, we gotten a few subscribers, a few guys to like us, a few laughs, and we got a lot of hate for what we did. <laughs> I mean, that was ridiculous. You know you're a hated group when somebody decides to make a review on a certain commentary that's very infamous only to have a commentary done on him and at the end of the review he says a certain line and the commentator replies back with wait you're part of that group Sonic and Tails for Life used to be a part of? well no wonder your stuff didn't make any sense I mean a lot of people said the videos that we made were pointless a lot of people said we were mean to people we were just we didn't we didn't give any criticism in the video. We we just ripped into the guy and all that shit and you know no one with half a brain didn't realize that one we did do criticism, but it was in our own style. We had a own style of doing those commentaries. And that was of the entertainment variety. Yes, criticism is going to be in there. You just got to know how to find it. And, you know, it's not really that hard to try to find any bit of criticism in our videos. You really have to pay attention. And two, I like how people say that every video we've ever done was pointless. When, in fact, the videos that they do are just as equally pointless as the next there's no such thing as a video that is relevant when it comes to commentaries it's like as a pointless video and yes I do commentaries too but I know this fact and I still do commentaries oh because of NMC I've actually improved in my videos fuck because of NMC I actually got Sony Vegas thanks E10 but then when you look at all the happy moments I had at NMC but then there was just moments that Certify heavily pissed me off. Uh, the strikes were one of them. I wasn't here for the Sega Camp strike. I think I came right. I think I came after all the shit with Sega Camp went on with the strikes. But I was here for one strike that um that you know kind of rose to my brows amongst some people in NMC and other people yeah it kinda raised some eyebrows um <laughs> cuz of one video that just some random geek made one video and a strike got put up got put against the channel because he mentioned this person's name because there was an apparent deal made that this person's name would never be mentioned. And apparently Geek broke that deal. Now, I'm not going to tell you whether it was real or bullshit or what, but Geek should have never made the video. We wouldn't have this strike if Geek didn't make the video. But he did. And he still sticks by what he said he still sticks by what he said and said that he was right for making the video and he still doesn't understand why he got kicked out of NMC and he believes that it was bullshit that he got kicked out of NMC but you know that's all in the past I'm just bringing up stuff that you know kinda pissed me off you know the things that were just irky, that irked me a little bit another thing that irks me is a matter which a lot of people, a lot of guys on NMC didn't know, but I kind of knew. 
Um, Cutter's video. If y'all remember who Cutter is, Cutter was a guy who used to like doing commentaries, but you know he 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 took a long a uh, long hard look at himself and he just said f you to the commentary community because he hated he thought everybody was retarded and he left the community. Mm hmm. Left the community, hated. Now Cutter did not like a certain user by the name of GNR and STP911. Oh yeah, I think y'all know where this is going. Now let me just remind you guys this. That video Cutter made was at least three months ago, by estimation. It was three months ago that that video was made. And from under the comments section, GNR was, you know, disagreeing with a lot of stuff he said. A lot of people, you know, um, a lot of people liked it. A lot of people were talking about it, all that stuff, you know. A mixed reaction of sorts, and then you had GNR kind of pissed off and going after Cutter for saying all those things about him. Right around the time NMC was down, and um, a lot of people were kind of leaving, that video gets flagged. Mm -hmm. The video gets flagged by by somebody by the name of Brian McLean. Yeah, dude, I know it was you, and I have to say this, you false flag a video that was made three months ago. So many things I can say about you right now, but I'm not going to. So many things. But I won't. Another thing that pisses me off, or that did piss me off, or, you know, kind of irked me a little bit, was the just the people that you know went after us a lot and hated us because they thought the videos that we did were pointless and i swear most of the comments we got were oh my god you're being so mean really i won't repeat myself on that part i really won't I already said it earlier, I'm not going to repeat myself. Long story short, NMC was a great channel that I loved being part of, and if I would go back and change anything about it, I wouldn't change a thing. I'd do it all over again. It was one hell of a ride, and I enjoyed every bit of it. So, that was my time and my thoughts about NMC before, you know, before the downfall, if you, if you say. And that's it for me, guys. I'm Loud Styles. I'm over. I'm out. And I am gone. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.